Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the channel. Today we have a weekly update video, so let's crack on with it. Starting off this video, let's talk about player ghouls. It looks like player ghouls will be getting some cards to bolster their strength within the wasteland. This includes thick skin. Your body now takes 10% less damage from ballistic attacks. This is pretty self-explanatory and it's quite nice to see another defensive card on the field for I believe non-power armor but obviously you're gonna have to be a ghoul for it breathe it in being the next one rads reduce uh, rad resistance is reduced by 50 now I believe that this probably is gonna be increased by 50 as in your resistance to rads is increased by 50 but uh, who knows I might be missing something with the way that is worded united ordeal being the next one when you're in a party with a ghoul character, you gain one special stat. That is pretty huge if you think about it. I, in, in my personal opinion, I think this is pretty huge. Plus one special stat, that includes endurance, which to be honest is quite difficult to get unless you put points into it because you can't get it from unyielding. And finally, arms of steel. Your steady arms will allow you to reduce ranged recoil increasing accuracy by 20 percent now i wonder if this is gonna work in vats this seems like a pretty nice card all round to be honest and the only sort of recoil management perk cards that i really know of is within the power armor where you get some recoil management and sort of i think smaller cone of fire as well uh, and accuracy with heavy weapons there are other perk cards it seems, but just not fully fleshed out. Those being Radioactive Strength, Glowing Gut, Radiation Power, Powerful Presence, Bone Shatterer, and Brick Wall. Let me know what you guys think this could be in the comments down below. Fallout 76 during 2021 teased a feature that has since been left in the dark. Now, there is a potential that the feature is getting a comeback and players might finally get new companions to join them during their adventures in the wastelands. Sugarbomb's Rad's data mine showcases the skeletal framework for an all new pet tutorial system, which is quite interesting. There has been camp pets teased in the past, but the only system that is set in stone at the moment is the current system. Using the animal friend as well as Wasteland Whisperer perk cards, each giving 75% chance to pacify a creature when aiming at them. Both can be found in Charisma. The issue with this system is your creature will be like any of its counterparts in the Wasteland, meaning fairly prone to finding itself dead and having you to tame a new one. Players are seeking for pets that are a little more robust, and I'm hoping the new system being datamined could be the answer for anyone seeking a Fallout 76 pet. The data mine also includes pet themed icons. This could suggest that there is a whole update percent potentially in the works based around companions. Who knows, scoreboard with pet themed stuff in the pipeline too? There was also talks about roaming trade caravans teased by Bethesda recently, links to the blog in the description below. And I talked about it a little bit, I believe, in my last video. There is also a like system that allows players to give camps they think are built well or they just enjoy. This will be a kind of like merit of sorts in the form of a like. I am not fully sure what this will really do outside of maybe a point system you can see on the map. And that will conclude this video. I hope you all enjoy the potential things that might be coming. And personally, I am interested in the pet system most of all. I think that's rather cool. And if it does arrive, it's definitely a sign of some pretty cool things coming to Fallout 76. Let me know in the comments down below what you all think. I'm going to leave the links to most of the information I obtained in the description down below. Cheers all for joining me. Thanks all for watching. And I'll catch you all on the next one.